Hi, everybody. I hope that you're doing well. I know that this is an unusual day for me to upload on Friday. I'll still be uploading this Sunday. I'll be uploading a part two. Um, these are my dogs and <laughs> they make me happy. I hope they make you a little bit happy too. I know that it's kind of a stressful time right now. And speaking of, I was never actually going to show you this video. However, um, it's good for a laugh. It's pretty funny. I got two plants that I ordered specifically because I've been looking into particulate matters indoors and ways that you can address it. There's a lot of particulate matter outdoors that gets indoors where I live. And so it recommended plants that have these kind of hairy leaves, the study so far. Now this plant has hairy leaves, but it also has something else. It came with a moth and I did not see this moth, right? I have no idea that it's there until Oh my God. Yeah, <laughs> kind of embarrassing, uh, kind of hysterical, not sure what I was doing, not sure why I was so frightened, but I ran away and uh, the moth ended up actually being really tired and ended up kind of falling by itself to the ground. I took it outside. It was fine. Came back <laughs> to come back in and I started going through looking at the plant, checking it out, going over it. It looks good. It's going to be on my patio this spring and summer. Um, and I hope I'm hoping it'll it'll help it green up a little bit. The seller said that the color that we're seeing is the result of it um, j being just about time for it to blossom. And so that'll be exciting. I got this second plant, same reason, super hairy leaves. Um, I don't know exactly what this plant is i know kind of its species and that's it um the seller just had it listed this way when i saw the picture of it initially uh, it was a different plant that was more mature so it was completely that deep burgundy color you see on the bottom leaves and the seller said that this plant once it is exposed to more light and it matures it will also develop to where the entire thing is that deep burgundy color so i'm really looking forward to that this is also out on my patio they get indirect light there it's pretty warm it's been rather humid here and so the temperature is I, I would say pretty comfortable for both of these plants and they're getting very bright indirect light so they're not getting any direct light um anyway i thought i'd show that to you <laughs> unprompted um i know that right now kind of things are really tense. So again, I hope this at least gave you a good chuckle. And until next time, be well and take care.